What's poppin' folks? Welcome to another video. Come here, boys. Come here, guys. I got the two boys with me today. Look at that manly bang fishing. right there. <laughs> the bang fishing <laughs> drink. Rainbow what is it? If you ain't banging, you, you ain't, ain't hanging. You ain't banging, you ain't hanging. <laughs> got my boy uh, fishing with Norm right here and then behind the camera. I always gotta do this. Andrew right there. Be sure to go check out all these boys' channels in the comment section below. But guys, we have something a little bit different today that I'm very excited about. It's actually a catch and cook. I've never done one before. As oh, you guys can shit. tell, we're at the old Walmart. We're gonna be getting supplies. We're gonna go out to the lake that Lojo has. We're gonna cook the fish. We're planning on cooking the fish on the water and everything. That's the, that's the whole plan. We're gonna go in here, buy it, and then get on to the lake. So since this is actually my first catch and cook ever, we're gonna need a lot of different things. I'm getting these boys to help me out today. So Lojo, what do you think is the first thing I need for this catch and cook? Well, I mean, we definitely need the fillet knife, right? Because I'm fillet pretty knife. sure none of us have a fillet knife. For sure. We're gonna need stuff to cook it with, seasoning. Seasoning. Right here is actually, you know, you got a ton of fillet knives right here. So we got this one, it's about $15, $12, $8. Oh, look at this right here. That's oh, all snap. purpose. Look at that, Look at that all-purpose fillet kit right there. It's got the knife sharpener. Is that a knife sharpener? Yeah, yeah. A little multi-tool. Yeah, that's crazy. What are the you know, scissors for? Baby pliers, some scissors. You use scissors to clean fish? You never know. I don't even know, that, brother. But guess what? I can use some scissors for some Dude, fishing lines. Perfect. I think we're gonna definitely go with this. This is nine dollars and forty-four cents. I mean, if you look at these knives up here, I mean, they're yeah. like twelve bucks. So you get some scissors, some pliers, knife sharpener, the whole fillet knife. This, this, and that, and a fishing fillet knife. Kit. I don't know if fish. And right. a fillet knife kit. What's the next thing, brother? Something to cook on, something right? To cook on. Something to, to cook so camping, on. Camping. 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 Yeah, probably so. All right. Here's the camping section. What we got here, brother man? You want to help out with this, bro? Yeah, man. You want to help out with this? He see, is this, the expert. This guy actually does a ton of catch and cook. See, I'm not. I don't do this a lot. If you guys didn't know, my dad's actually allergic to fish. So it wasn't something where, you know, I caught a fish, cooked that son of a gun, and my dad ate it. That's, so I actually did film a bunch of stuff like that with my grandfather, but you know, he did all the work. So Andrew, what's the next step, brother? We got the fishing now kit. That's what we need. Oh, what <laughs> is that? <laughs> it's just, that's, that's what we need right there. Oh, there you go. All right, Andrew, what you thinking? So I think if you're gonna cook on the water, you're gonna need a grill. Something that you can heat up the pan at least when you're out there. Like a little mini portable grill. Yeah, exactly, basically. exactly. Dude, that's like a covered. knife, a fork, and a spoon. Oh, oh dude, you gotta pretty... get that. Oh yeah, hundred percent, hundred percent. This with that. That's cool. One hundred percent. Heck yeah! All right, back to Andrew. Show me the juice, brother. So what, what I'm thinking is this little thing right here. Oh, that's it. That's it right there. Look that's at this, Lojo and Norm. Though. Look at this. That's it, brother. Okay, so that's like a little burner. Yep. But so we now we're gonna need, need the, yeah we need yep. that part because that like, the picture you can see that's right there that's oh that's perfect so we're gonna be able to cook this whole dang thing on the water but guess what we got to cook it on something yeah, right we, we need, need like a pan, pan. so do they have any pans here now what about that one right there that's another fit that's like a little kit do you look at this package oh, dude. it's like been torn open and taped let's yeah, get that let's get that a brand new one how about that let's see what see what's in dude, there dude this is like we are getting all the kits today boys we got this one right here we got that one right there. Then we got the old burner. This is perfect. A five-piece mess kit. Mess kit? What does mess that mean? Kit. So you no get a 6.7-inch fry pan, a 6.5-inch plate, a 7-ounce cup, a lid, and a quarter pot. What do you think about that, Norm? I like it. You like it? You like it a lot? All right. So anyways, guys, we got this bad boy right here. We got the old fillet kit. And then old Andrew got us with the burner right here. Spoon oh, knife fork combo right. here. Oh heck yeah! That thing's actually really freaking cool. That's, that's sweet because really cool. that does not come with utensils and stuff. So that's perfect. What's the next step, boys? You need something to season the fish with. Something. Unless you just want to eat like straight up freshly caught fish that's yeah. not seasoned, which is a little. Yeah, we need. You gotta sauce it up. You probably need to sauce gotta spice it, it up. Yeah, a little bit of spicy, a yeah. little bit of Chef saucy. Kicking the bass TV. Yeah, this, this will have pan too. And it should have to see. I'm a little short, Lojo. <laughs> Can you reach your long arm color? Which one? Which one are you trying to get? The one dollar one, all the way in the back. Oh, he can't even reach. One dollar one. You talking about? Yeah, it's the veg. The what is that? Is there a pan one? You want this one's one dollar? Yeah, that's it's fine. butter flavored. That's cool, bro. It's not pan pan, but at least it's butter flavored, non-stick cool. cooking spray. That's cool, <laughs> so, brother. We're all about budget fishing, all right? This is budget. Oh, Norman, what is your favorite seasoning of oh, all dude. time, brother? I have no clue. 
What do you mean you have no clue? I don't have a, If I, you were stranded and you had to cook a fish, what would you put on it? I don't know. I'm not a chef. Well, well, I've well, never well, cooked well, a darn fish. Well, well, this well, is the well, first for me. They got fish mustang? They got what? Fish mustang? <laughs> you, you said that Creole seasoning looks good. Yeah, Creole's pretty good, man. And there's only one of these left. I mean, there was only one. So I'm assuming that this that this is going to be really good. Honestly, I think that's the juice. This stuff's pretty good, dude, but if yeah. you put it too much on something, yeah. dude, it will trigger your nose. You will be caught yeah. <laughs> for literally 30 minutes. So True. this is good. We got the Creole seasoning. We got the butter flavor. Great value. Spray. Butter. Oil. Yeah, non-stick spray. <laughs> um, what else do we need, man? Are we good? I think, I think that's, that's a wrap. Yeah, are we good, brother? Yeah, yeah man. You, you got to check yeah, you're on You're the us. professional. Let's yeah. do a check good. before we yeah. leave. Yeah. We actually got everything that we need for this whole catch and cook deal for my first time. One thing I would like to ask you guys is, what am I missing that you guys usually bring on your catch and cooks? Leave a comment in the comment section below if I missed anything. But let's go ahead and walk this through. Got the old burner right there. We're gonna do this quick and simple. Butter flavored. Um, <laughs> and then we got the old Creole seasoning. We had to get a little something to spice the fish up, make it sexy and uh, delicious. What's going on back there? Did that just fall on you? Like out of nowhere? <laughs> <laughs> Is there a human being back there? In the horn, I even spotted in my forts. <laughs> it's actually pretty sweet back there. I made a whole crib. He almost went to sleep. <laughs> Anyways, we got the old Creole seasoning, make the fish sexy, spicing it up, a little flavor to the action. Uh, maybe we could pick a lemon from a tree or something when we're out there. But anyways, we got the old uh, propane. This is a propane butane mix. This is going to go on, on the bottom of that old thing right there. We got the filet fishing kit right here. This is going to be perfect. I'm actually excited that we found this. Inexpensive. Only $9. So that's going to be killer. And then lastly, or actually we got two more things. We got the um, pan kit. And then lastly, this is the That's the game changer right there. Yeah, this is like totally. You know what's funny is every time I go to, I think about that. Every time I like read the word sport. What comes to your mind when you think of spork? Spork? I can't say what comes Star to Trek? my mind. Star Trek? Who yeah. has a spork? I don't know if they have it anymore. Who had a spork for the longest time, man? KFC? I think they did. No, they no, did. I think they did. They did. But they're partnering companies with, come on, bro. Taco Bell? Yeah, Taco Bell. Okay, yeah, Taco yeah, Bell yeah, had yeah, the sporks, right. man. You're right, you're right. Every time I read spork. But anyways, we got the spork, uh, spoon, sporks, and a knife. Spork combo, and a knife, yeah. Heck yeah, boys. That's all the stuff. Let's go ahead and buy it, get out to the place. Actually, we gotta get a live bait. Yeah, we're still getting live bait, boys. Stay tuned. Don't skip through. Let's get it rolling. Yours doesn't make a noise. So we got a total fifty-three dollars eighty-six cents. We're gonna go ahead and pay this. Not too bad. You know, we got a whole catch and cook fishing kit, fishing setup. It's pretty good. Like a half a tail or something. Little bit out right there. I guess that'd be a good thing. Perfect. Uh, it's legal here. Just uh, ring me up for ten. Just give me ten. <laughs> that is the cutest dog I've ever seen in my life. I support anybody who does that. Yeah, exactly. I'm saying. All right, guys. So we're good. We got the live bait. This place was a really cool place, man. They had some cute pets in there. Let me tell you that. <laughs> the crappie shack. If you guys are around Alabama area, come check them out, man. They got a cool little place, ton of little tanks of goldfish, turtles, bass. That's pretty cool, man. Yeah. I love the little mom and pop shops like that. It's good to support these places too. Um, even though we go to like Dick's and Walmart and it's Bass true. Pro all the time, it's awesome to support little places like this. But let's go ahead and get out, start fishing. That way, nobody. Oh. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, that's yeah. Cool. All right, guys, just made it out to this beautiful pond that old Lojo put us on. Um, I'm sure you guys have seen this in some of his videos. It's a little bit slippery out here. <laughs> we got uh, two of Lojo's rods, spinning combos, already rigged up with bobbers, um, split shots, small hooks, and also, oh, 
got the live bait right here. So let's get a little little peep real quick. Oh gosh, yeah. Some of them are dying yeah, off. Let's double, look at that, baby. Oh, dude, that's gonna catch a freaking bass right that, there, baby. dude. Those are the smaller ones right there. This is gonna be perfect for those little crappie. That's the bait. We're gonna rig some up, cast out there, see if we can get some big crappie to cook up. And man, I'm excited, bro. Or anything. If we catch a bass, but I would love just to catch a. I'm not gonna cook a big bass, obviously, but I'd love to catch a big bass just for a surprise. But um, let's get this started, boys. Yes, this split shot, dog. All right, guys. First cast, making it happen. The thing, the thing about crappies is, is they'll just drag your bobber all over, but they won't have it all the way. Get them. Oh! oh that was Mel. Bro, look at that. He got it. <laughs> Well, that's a good sign, you know, we're getting bites. Clean hook, oh, 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 my toe. <laughs> go, go, go. Got him? Yep, you got something. He got one. Oh, get him out of that grass. Oh, oh it's a crappie. Oh, 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 it's a crappie. It's a good one. Oh, snap. It's a good one. Oh, oh yes, sir. Oh, that's snap, what we need baby. right there, baby. Skeet. Oh, uh, they're coming to get us. They're coming to get us. We're catching too many fish. All right, boys, first fish today. It's a very small crappie. Um, we're going to try to get some bigger ones. But that is awesome to catch the first fish today. Man, that's fun. I don't get the live bait fish much. This just brings it back to the old days, guys. Oh my that's awesome. God. Got him. Got him. Got him. Got him. Oh, you got a really good line, man. Oh, you got Wait. You still got one. <laughs> oh, you still got him. Bigger one. Bigger one. Bigger one. Bigger one. Oh, still got the minute. Oh, yes, sir. Yes. Dude, this is next cast, baby. Look at this. This is awesome right here. Look at that. See the minnow in his mouth? Heck oh, yeah, look at that. Still got the bait. We're gonna have to put a new one on. Another small one, man. We need some big ones, but I think it's gonna happen. It's oh, happening got, really oh, quick. He's got, one. He's, got one. he's got one. Get him, boy. Oh, oh it's his got best. Him. Got him, no, it's another crappie. Ooh, bigger ooh. one, bigger one, bigger one. Oh, that's a freaking, That's it, bro. Yeah, that's it. Oh, that's the biggest one. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's a freaking big one. That's a, that's a pretty go, one, bro. Too. That's a pretty one. Hey, Norm, get out there right here. Let's triple up. Yeah. <laughs> Let's triple up, bro. There we go, guys. We just doubled up right here. Norm, do not hook me. <laughs> you got him his way. Oh, that's a mighty oh. gas, Norm. Norm's gonna slot He's about to catch the biggest bass in the pond. All right, this one I'm actually gonna release. This is yeah. a little smaller. Yeah, this is um, bigger. That one's bigger. We're gonna put them in the yeah. little bucket just yeah. in case we might end up releasing them later if we can get some bigger ones. But yeah, this guy's going back in the water. There he goes. Let's get back out there. This is the first one Noah caught, but we just put it up to the one I just caught. Mine's definitely the biggest so far, so we're gonna let this bad boy go too. Got him! Got him! Got him, boys! Got him! Oh, he's a good one too. He looks Got like. Got him! Eh. Let's see. Let's see. He's uh. That's tough. that's bigger than your first two. That's bigger. Oh, that's for sure. That's the one. He's not the biggest yeah, man. Yeah, he's not the biggest. You know. Good looking little fish though. It is a good looking fish. I want to reel mine in. Good cast. Oh, that's, that's perfect. One, yeah. Oh, right that there. Leave him right there. Game over, Norm. Is there some slack out, Norm? Yeah. All right. Right I don't think much is anywhere. You got him, Norm. Oh, you, you got him good, good. too. Oh. Yeah, you got him. Oh, oh get him oh, in. Oh, that's a good one. one. That's a good one. Woo. Let's go, baby. That's a good one, too. That's They're all about the same size, but that's still a good one. That's where they look so big, man. Off the bat. Hey, look at this. Uh oh. 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 Well, brain damage. Gotta cook that one. Look at that, guys. They're gonna be there. That's a good one, but we've caught even some bigger ones in here, but we're gonna go ahead. Let's gotta go. All right, buddy. I'm gonna warn you guys right now, we're about to get to the whole filet deal. So if you guys don't wanna see this, I don't blame you at all, you can skip through. I'm only gonna add a little bit of it. Let's go ahead and get it started. Since this is actually my first catch and cook, buddy Andrew right here, he's he does this a lot, okay? I'm gonna get him to you know show everybody the whole filet process. I might try it out myself. We're running a little low on time, but Andrew's gonna take the lead here for a second and we're gonna cook some fish now. All right, guys, so we got three fish. This one is the smallest. We're not trying to eat these nuggets, so we're gonna put this one back and uh, keep the spot pretty good. We're not gonna keep this nugget right here. He's just, a, he's just it's a little crappy. chicken nugget. He ain't no chicken tender. So we have two crappy. So we're gonna fillet these crappy right now. Get them ready to throw on the pan. I'm gonna help Noah out. We've been. I come from Alabama. We cook stuff up. Alabama. Alabama. If you find it dead, you can eat it. I'm gonna come down above this gill plate to the to the backbone cut through the rib cage until I get to the end of the tail. So I'm trying to stick super close to the backbone to get as much meat as we can. We don't want to cut through, so we keep it right there. Now I'm gonna bend the knife and stay really close, get all these scales off, 
There you go. Boom, there we got a fillet and we're gonna cut these bones out so you're not having a good time in about two hours. That's a solid crappy fillet right there, my dude. No, it's trying to learn how to pull that thin back right here. So we'll just go. Yeah. Yep, yep. There it is. Once you get started, you can bend that knife a little bit and it kind of will come right up. Yeah, that's perfect. Dude. Yeah, you're doing good. Just to let you guys know beforehand, you know, we're not just killing these just to kill them. You know, we're killing them, we're gonna eat them. And you know, this is a little learning lesson for me, you know, to, to learn new things and try new things, especially since we got the old master over here that does this all the time, man. This is pretty cool. I've been wanting to do one of these for a long time. If you guys are enjoying it, be sure to hit the subscribe button, like button. Let me know in the comment section below if you do want to see another one of these. I'd love to do it. You know, this is neat, something different. I'm having a blast. Is it going? Yeah. yeah, it's going. Yep. Oh yeah, I can see it. <laughs> oh <laughs> yeah. It? Yeah. That's crazy. I thought it would be a flame, but there's no flame. It's just, I mean, I guess there's a small flame you can't see. See how long it takes to get it, get it hot. Oh that's yeah, what, that's baby. That's what you want to hear right there. Probably cook it like just like a minute on each side. They're so small. Yeah, for sure. Oh. You good? <laughs> About oh, pop me in my freaking eye, bro. Uh -huh. Oh, easy. Oh gosh, Logan. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I guess Lojo likes seasoning. <laughs> I'm gonna flip them, but nah, I just meant like. It actually, smells while. really good, dude. Yeah, with that Creole seasoning, it's gonna help. That does smell good. It smells amazing, Jeez. dude. I smell like I'm a five star restaurant right now, bro. Sure. Five star restaurant on the water. Oh, baby. Lojo hey. spicing it up, boy. Hey. Oh, that looks amazing. Smells even better. I wish you guys could smell it through the camera. I'm about to take a bite of this crappie, man. Crappy mm -mm. crappie. Yo, you guys mind if I take one of the big ones? No, oh, go for it. Hammer it. Gains. Oh, Gain oh, no. season, baby. Right. Gains. Right? Gain season. You already know. All right. The spoon's We don't got any, like, uh, sauce or anything? No. But that Creole. I'm right. telling you, that Creole's going to be right. sauce. Not all, man. We don't have any tartar sauce on us. How is it? His face. It, the flavor's there, but it's like, yeah, oh, <laughs> get out of here. The flavor was good, but I mean, it was like, is it super fishy? It, it, it's not super fishy. It was just like mushy. Well, like yeah. really Try mushy. But My, not good. Yeah. Well, Mojo's <laughs> going in, man. All right. It's all Creole. Pass it around. I guess I'll, my I camera's blinking. I too much Creole on there. No, oh my, I kind of like that though. Yeah. Oh, he took a slob of a bite. Noah's gonna love it because it's spicy, man. Should I just go go Full all out? Go, go, go for it, damn. Yo, hold up. I'm, I'm gonna get another bite. <laughs> pretty good, You're bro. Right. It ain't bad. I'm hungry, man. Imagine if you hadn't eaten in a couple days and you fire one of these bad boys up. No, like actually? You'd be good to go. No, I'm not even kidding. Like, let me get a little bit more, homie. It tastes really freaking good. It's just the texture's a little weird. The texture's off because we're not. It's definitely yeah. the seasoning. The seasoning helps a lot. Yeah. I need, a, I need that. I'll let you have the last bite, man. Finish off strong, baby. It's actually really good, dude. Is it? I got, it's actually banging, dude. This bite is like straight Cajun seasoning, bro. I don't know. It's just lumps of Cajun seasoning. <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah, it's it's good, pretty bro. good, though. One thing I like to say is we cleaned up everything today. I really promote, you know, picking up after yourself and not leaving trash like this guy probably did. So we're going to. Yeah, Pick I got up. more trash too that I found. I don't there. promote littering at all. Pick up all your stuff, guys. Don't ever leave stuff on the ground. I'm a big yeah. supporter in that. Sorry, girl, I got a ghost. Uh, yeah, you know this ain't the old man.